Hi, I'm Dr. Puyan Femini, an endocrinologist at the UCLA Endocrine Center. Today, let's discuss the treatment option for Graves' disease. Treatment options include antithyroid drugs, radioactive iodine, and surgery. Usually, we start with antithyroid drugs. These are medications that reduce how much thyroid hormone the thyroid makes. While taking these medications, some patients go into remission. That is when the immune system calms down and stops attacking the body. If you go into remission, antithyroid medications can usually be stopped. Usually, it takes at least 18 months before that happens. If you do not go into remission, or you go into remission but the Graves' disease comes back, we start to think about other treatments. This is because antithyroid medications do sometimes cause side effects, and in rare cases, they can cause liver and bone marrow problems. There are two ways of treating Graves' disease for good. There is radioactive iodine treatment and surgery. Radioactive iodine therapy uses a form of iodine called I-131 that kills thyroid cells. Or surgery is a second option. Surgery involves completely removing the thyroid gland. After radioactive iodine treatment, some people do not have enough thyroid tissue left to make thyroid hormone. After surgery to remove the thyroid gland, everyone needs to take thyroid hormone replacement. The choice between radioactive iodine and surgery depends on many things which you should discuss with your endocrinologist or endocrine surgeon. For more information or to schedule an appointment, please call our office. I'm Dr. Puyan Femini. Thanks for watching.